So we're going to give you a live demo of how our system works. So you'll see it on the monitor. I'm going to step away and I'm going to control it from my computer right here in the corner. So first what you see is you begin with a map. So I can zoom out and you can see that this is actually a system that we have set up in Europe. So this is Europe. This is the Swiss Alps. This is Lake of Zurich, that's the city of Zurich. And as you zoom in to the southwest of Zurich, you get to the area of our office and the field in front of our office that we use for range testing. So I zoom in a little bit further, you can see our office and I can switch into 3D. So now you see our office in 3D. This is a photo reconstructed image of a property. I can see, I can show you a geofence. So here we restrict where the drone is allowed to fly just to stay within this yellow box. We also map the site for obstacles, so the field doesn't have any obstacles. The building is, of course, an obstacle. And then over the street, we have these two pillars, and that's to prevent the drone from flying over the street. If it needs to cross the street, it goes to this little gap right here. We call it the crosswalk for the drone. I'm going to turn this off. I'm going to turn this off as well. Um, and I'm going to basically show you uh, a live flight. So this is our office. This is our system set up in front of the main door of our office. And I'm going to take a look. I'm just going to fly out and take a look at the system itself. Over on the left, you see a preview of what I expect to see based on the 3D reconstruction. I click inspect. The drone thinks for two seconds. The doors open up. It takes off. And what you see is a live video of a drone flying. It is in Switzerland, so it's already night. You can see we switched into night mode. There at the bottom, you see our our base station right there below us. And now I'm in the air and I can look around. It's just like a PTZ camera. I can go full screen. I can turn on my PTZ controls. And I can just look left, look right, go up. Go up a couple more times. Look around, zoom in, whatever I need to do. If I need to fly somewhere else, I can choose a different location. So I can click this mission tab and say, you know, I want to take a look at let me just pick something random here. Uh, I want to go look at the garage. Um, let me just search for it. Garage. Yep, here's the garage. Let's go take a look at our garage. I click inspect. Again, the drone thinks. It plans its route. It knows there's an obstacle. It knows there's a building. It's navigating around it. It's going to come to the garage. It's going to descend. And it's going to take a nice good look at the garage itself. It is closed. So that's good. I can look around a little bit more if I want to. So no one is breaking in into my house now, but our office, but if somebody was and I wanted to chase them around, I can do this. I can click this little key button right here and I can double click anywhere on the property. And from the video, we will figure out what you clicked on and fly directly there. So if there's somebody on my property I needed to chase, I can just double click and the system knows, oh, that's the location in 3D. As a matter of fact, I can even show you how we do, how we do the planning. At the bottom right corner, you see the 3D map of how we do the planning and how to get there. Likewise, I can even do this in the 2D map. So I can turn around and I can say, I want to look at this top garage. I double click there. You see a little blob appears, a little target appears. The drone plans its route, flies around, finds that location. Maybe I want to take a look at the building. Maybe I want to take a look at the, oops. Uh, I want to take a look at the third floor of the building. I just double click on the 3D map on the right in the third floor of the building. The drone sees that location, switches over to that path planner, goes directly to that location, and takes a look at the third floor. All right, looks like we're nice and safe. Nobody's attacking us. So let's just go home. I'm going to exit this mode. I'm going to say land. Say so go ahead. And what you saw earlier about our landing system, here the system basically figures out where the base station is. It's right there in the front of the building. Switch into the full screen view. It goes above it. The doors open up at the last second. It switches to its landing beacon. It starts descending based on our proprietary landing system until it reaches the base station. It's just going to touch the funnel, slide in. You can see the golden rings of, for the recharging. The system finished. You have an alert uh, or a, a report of the flight. The system does some self tests and it's ready to fly again, seconds notice. So that's my demo.